when we talk about richer nations, we must consider a number of factors. It's important to remember that having a large economy does not automatically make a country rich. For example, India has a GDP of $3 trillion. However, there are still many poor people in the country. Its massive population is the reason behind this. The best and most widely used approach for measuring a country's wealth is to look at its GDP per capita. This statistic illustrates how much money a country's government must spend on each individual resident. Without any further delay, let's take a look at the list of the top 10 richest countries in the world in 2021. Top 10. Denmark Denmark has a service-based economy that is contemporary and internationally competitive. Denmark's GDP per capita is around 60,692 US dollars. It is one of the few economies in the world that has been avoiding the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. This country has a population of around 6 million people. Manufacturing, tourism, and petroleum product exports are the main sources of income for the Danish people. Denmark has a high employment rate, which explains why it consistently ranks first among the world's happiest countries. Top 9. Hong Kong Hong Kong's economy is distinguished by low taxation, no capital gains or inheritance taxes, no tariffs on goods imports or exports, and complete ownership of a company for foreigners who do not have to be citizens, residents, or nationals. As a result, despite its small size of 1,104 square kilometers or 427 square miles, this tiny island is incredibly diverse. This isn't to imply that the city's 7.5 million residents are all poor. According to government figures, one out of every five people lives in poverty. Meanwhile, Hong Kong is competing with New York for the title of world metropolis with the most ultra-high net worth individuals, with approximately 9,000 people with a net worth of $30 million or more. Top 8. Brunei Darussalam Brunei's economy, despite its modest size and riches, is a blend of international and native business, government regulation and welfare programs, and village traditions. It is nearly totally reliant on crude oil and natural gas exports, with petroleum income accounting for more than half of GDP. The country's per capita GDP is large and substantial income from overseas investment supplements domestic production. All medical services are provided by the government, while food and housing are subsidized. The government's main aim of diversifying the economy away from oil and gas has made headway. Although it has taken attempts to become a more significant player by serving as chairman of the APEC conference in 2000, Brunei's leaders are afraid that continuously increasing integration in the global economy may weaken local social cohesiveness. Due to increasing oil prices in the second half of 1999, growth was anticipated to be 2.5%. Brunei is Southeast Asia's third largest oil producer, producing around 180,000 barrels per day on average. It is also the world's ninth largest producer of liquefied natural gas. Top 7. United States Did we mention that the richest nations are also the smallest? Of course, this is not the situation for the United States, which, despite a challenging 2020, managed to climb into the top 10 after teetering on the edge for the better part of two decades. But, did the pandemic make Americans wealthier? It varies depending on who you ask. Certainly not those who lost their jobs and businesses and were left with massive medical bills and other expenses to pay who waited in line at food banks, those in the top quintile of the population, earning more than $60,000 per year, were able to work from home in many situations, see their stock assets grow in value, and receive stimulus checks on top of that. Many of the world's tech giants, such as Apple and Microsoft, have their headquarters in the United States. It invites billionaires from all around the world to invest a huge amount. Aside from that, the United States possesses rich natural resources. Top 6. Norway Norway is also one of Europe's richest nations. Oil is the lifeblood of the country's economy. It is Western Europe's largest oil-producing country. The country has a very high standard of living compared with other European countries and a strongly integrated welfare system. Norway's modern manufacturing and social systems rely on a financial reserve generated from natural resource exploitation.
The Norwegian economy has shrunk little in recent years, but it is still on the list of the world's richest countries in 2021. Before we continue to the top 5, don't hesitate to smash that like button. Top 5. Switzerland Switzerland's economy is one of the most advanced free market economies in the world. The service sector, particularly the Swiss banking industry and tourism, has evolved to play a substantial economic role. In the 2015 Global Innovation Index, Switzerland's economy is ranked first in the world and third in the 2020 Global Competitiveness Report. Is it really surprising that Switzerland has the world's highest percentages of millionaires? According to the most recent estimates, for every 100,000 residents, there are 9,428 of them 11.8% of the total, considering just the adult population. Top 4. Qatar Qatar's economy is one of the world's richest in terms of GDP per capita consistently placing among the top 10 richest countries according to World Bank, United Nations, and IMF data from 2015 and 2016. Despite restrictions imposed by Saudi Arabia and the United Arab Emirates, the country's economy has expanded. Petroleum and natural gas are the backbones of Qatar's economy, accounting for more than 70% of total government revenue, 60% of GDP, and nearly 85% of export earnings. Qatar has the world's third-largest proven natural gas reserves and is the world's second-largest natural gas exporter. Top 3. Ireland The Republic of Ireland's economy has a highly developed knowledge economy with high-tech, life sciences, financial services, and agriculture, particularly agri-food, as its main sectors. Ireland is an open economy that ranks first in high-value foreign direct investment flows fifth on the Index of Economic Freedom. Ireland is ranked fourth out of 186 countries in the IMF table and fourth out of 187 countries in the World Bank table in terms of GDP per capita. Ireland appeared unstoppable until lately. While the rest of Europe was troubled by uncertainty, the Irish economy continued to thrive in 2019. While the Eurozone grew by only 1.2%, the Irish economy grew by over 5.9%, cementing its position as the continent's fastest-growing country. All of that reversed in 2020, when economic growth was more than half from prior levels, though it is anticipated to pick up again this year. Top 2. Singapore The World Economic Forum has placed Singapore's economy as the most open, the third least corrupt, and the most pro-business in the world. Singapore has low tax rates and the world's second-highest purchasing power parity per capita GDP PPP. Singapore is the headquarters of the Asia-Pacific Economic Cooperation. But how did Singapore achieve such prosperity? One half of the city population state was illiterate when it gained independence in 1965. Singapore, with almost no natural resources, pulled itself up by the bootstraps through hard work and smart policy becoming one of the world's most business-friendly places. Singapore is now a thriving trade, manufacturing and financial center. Most importantly, 98% of the adult population is now literate. That is not to say it has been immune to the effects of the global downturn. The economy fell 5.4% in 2020, plunging the country into recession for the first time in more than a decade. Top 1. Luxembourg Luxembourg is a small country in the heart of Europe. Luxembourg can be visited for its castles and beautiful countryside, cultural festivals, or gastronomic specialties. You could also open an offshore account with one of its banks and never leave, as many people do. Luxembourg devotes a large portion of its wealth to providing better housing, healthcare, and education to its citizens, who have by far the highest standard of living in the Eurozone. Nonetheless, while the global financial crisis and EU and OECD pressure to reduce banking secrecy had little effect on the economy, the coronavirus outbreak forced many businesses to close and workers to lose their jobs. Nonetheless, Luxembourg has fared better than most of its European neighbors due to effective testing and contact tracing measures. As a result, the Grand Duchy's GDP will increase by 4% in 2021 up from minus 1.3% in 2020. 
In 2014, the country surpassed $100,000 in per capita GDP and has never looked back since. Even a pandemic wouldn't be able to change that. So, Luxembourg is the richest country in the world as of 2021. That's it for today's top videos. If you like this video, please don't hesitate to share this, so others will know what is the richest country in the world. Also, don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell so you won't miss out on our new top videos. Thank you.